Thanks a lot for staying with us. Another batch of 161 stranded Nigerians have been repatriated back to the country from Libya, and they arrived to the cargo wing of the uh, Muratala Mohammed International Airport Ikeja at about 11 p.m. on Tuesday. The profile of the new returnees indicates that 100 adult females, as well as 37 adult males, 9 female children and 7 male children were all aboard the flights that departed uh, the Tripoli Airport. NAPTIP, the Refugee Commission, as well as the Federal Aviation Authority of Nigeria were all at the airport to receive the returnees. And in River State, the Joe National Congress has thrown its weight behind the state governor, Simina Lai Fubara, as he works to resolve the ongoing political crisis. The leaders of the group at a meeting in Port Harcourt say they are backing the governor to complete his tenure uninterrupted. Senior reporter Ucho Kuru has details. The recent political happenings in River State have divided stakeholders into three camps. Some are on the fence, refraining from publicly taking sides. Others have come out openly in support of the former governor, Nyesom Wike. But the Ijon National Congress Eastern Zone can be counted amongst those who have chosen to stand with the incumbent governor, Siminalai Fubara. Continued meddling. In their opinion, this is merely a fight over access to the resources of the state. Impeachment process is a democratic process. But you cannot also impeach anybody without any cogent reason. For the few months that Similae Fubra has been governor of River State, I don't think we have found any reason to impeach him. If that is a witch hunting by an individual who wants to use him as a subterfuge to siphon the River State economy, if that process starts, we will resist it vehemently. They frowned at the perceived interference of the FCT minister in the governance of River State. We care should let our governor seem breathe and exercise his political and an administrative dexterity and ingenuity without further interference from the further from the former governor. The former governor, as we know him, will never accept that kind of interference. Not even from His Excellency Good Lord Jonathan, the former president, or his wife, Mrs. Patient Jonathan, who has been instrumental to his, to his political ascension as minister and also as governor of River State. For the first time since 1999, River State produced a riverine governor, and that's Mr. Siminalai Fubara. And so it is no surprise that the Ijo National Congress is rallying around him, even though the socio-political group says they are echoing the thoughts of all ethnic nationalities in the state. TVC News, Port Harcourt.